Proper vaccine storage and handling are crucial to maintain vaccine potency and protection against vaccine preventable diseases. Because you work with vaccines, you need to know how to determine whether a vaccine can be administered based on its expiration date or beyond use date or time, also known as the BUD. Even though all vaccines have an expiration date set by the manufacturer, some also have a beyond use date or time, or BUD. The beyond use date is different from the expiration date. It indicates the final date or time when an alter vaccine can be used. Alteration occurs when a vaccine vial is moved between storage states, such as from a freezer to a refrigerator, or a refrigerator to room temperature, or when it's mixed with a diluent, or when the vial is punctured. For vaccine products that have a BUD, the designated time frame is not always the same and varies between vaccines. The BUD replaces the manufacturer's expiration date, but never extends it. Always use the earlier date or time when reviewing the two dates. For example, once a vial has been punctured, its beyond use date may be 24 hours after puncture, even though its expiration date may be a month away. Unlike the expiration date, which is determined by the manufacturer, the BUD is determined by the healthcare provider using guidance included in the vaccine's package insert or fact sheet. After calculating the BUD, label the vial with the BUD and the initials of the staff member making the calculation. This can be done in a variety of ways. If only one vial needs labeling, write the information on the vial label or use a sticker. If multiple vials or syringes need to be labeled, such as when moving from a freezer to a refrigerator at the same time, keep them together in a tray or resealable plastic bag with a clear label. Administering a vaccine past the expiration date or the BUD is considered a vaccine administration error. Several best practice strategies can be followed to help prevent this from happening. First, Check expiration dates of your entire vaccine stock weekly. Place those with an earlier expiration date in the front so that they can be used first. Remove any expired vaccines from the storage unit and discard. Ongoing monitoring of expiration and BUD dates is critical for inventory management and to ensure the safety and efficacy of vaccines. Second, Always review the package inserts or fact sheets for the vaccines in your inventory. Know which vaccines have a BUD and know how to calculate it. Finally, when preparing vaccines and before administering vaccines, always check the expiration date or BUD if applicable. Remember, the BUD replaces but never exceeds the expiration date. Always use the earlier date or time. If you have questions about vaccine expiration dates, beyond use dates or times, or expiration date calculations, refer to the vaccine's package insert or fact sheet or contact the manufacturer. You also can contact CDC at nipinfo at cdc.gov for help with your vaccine-related questions, including those on storage, preparation, and administration. Please visit CDC's website for more training and resources to support your vaccination efforts, including the Vaccine Storage and Handling Toolkit, Pink Book, and You Call the Shots web-based trainings.